Hello everyone, we are in the island of Margalo and this island is by kcali.crossing and that is k-c-a-l-i dot crossing and this is a beautiful flag, really like that. That is super cute and wow, I really like this cactus. So I'm pretty sure this is a springtime cactus um, pink and blue, no, pink and green colored island. So let's see, this is already looking very creative and interesting. Wow, this is already so stunning. I love it. This is just beautiful. I'm super excited to get on with the tour. So we will just make ourselves to the entrance and we already are already here. And there's so many bunnies around. So this is the island of Margalo, and this is Cali, and the villagers. Very interesting and fun villagers. I would like to see Quinn. Quinn looks really cool. Um, hopefully we'll see them around. I want to see how they look like, because I've never seen them. And there's a bunch of waterscaping and terraforming, especially in the campsite. Yeah, there's a lot, so I'm ready to see it. This looks so cool already. Like it's such a really unique and interesting theme. So there is that entrance. It is super beautiful. I love all the colors. It's just very spring and natural. So here's a bunch of motorcycles par parked right there. And Kiki is so cute. And here is the beach. I really like that. There are so many beautiful cactuses so far. It's just so nice. Oh my gosh, I want to do a volleyball beach. That would be great. There's a lot of lights. And the cherry blossom trees. Wow, this is a very fun theme. And look at this beautiful, I think this is a plant shop. It's really pretty. Wow. Such a beautiful plant shop. And there is so many animals in this island. A lot of bunnies and ducks. And we got this villager's house. And a lot of outdoor swimming pools, outdoor ponds. And I saw this beautiful pergola with the wisteria plants. I have never seen anyone do this theme, ever. So here is the museum. And then we're on the beach, a little beach carnival. I really like this stand, this game, and this carousel. Really cool to do a beach carnival. That sounds really fun.
we got a boat and fishing area and then over there we got natural with a lot of inflatable swans all around the island And we got a lot of lakes. A little sitting area. And the lakes look very natural. I love this bridge. bunch of flowers and this is a villager's house and a little bakery right next to Abel sisters these are beautiful designs for dresses oh my goodness this pie looks really nice I've never seen it so here's another little bakery or outdoor kitchen And here's that bakery. I love this set setup. Really cute. There's a lot of pink in this island, which I really love. And we go down. And this is a tea area. And this villager's house. Very cool, like, movement on the island. Like, there's so many inclines and, like, trails, bridges. It's so fun to walk around. And it's so, um, I was gonna say, well, yeah, it's elevated. A lot of, um, inclines and bridges. So that just makes it, it adds a lot of character and it makes it more fun walking around it. So here is a house, a residence house. So let's go ahead and see the inside. And the inside is not decorated, but that is totally okay because honestly it's not it's not your top priority some people want to do it but it's really not a big deal if you don't because i know it's very hard to do decorating every single room but the exterior looks really good little pond right here
they are so good at terraforming. Like, this is just so interesting to look at. It's so fun. It's very unique. There's like so many different shapes of cliffs. And we got that little lookout area, little Easter setup down there. It just looks so cool with so much water. It's such a large terraforming spot in the island. This is probably the most fun the the most fun island I've ever been on. And here is that bird that we were talking about. She is actually or they are actually so stunning. Look at those colors. Very very beautiful bird. Yeah, so this island is the most fun island I've ever been on because it's so fun to just explore go up and down the incline there's little trails that lead you everywhere it is just super fun and whimsical so this island is just really cool and here is that stunning land bridge And this is a villager's house. And a sitting area. Hello, I love your dress. And you did an amazing job with this island. Um, their dress is so cute, very spring, very pastel. Very cool island, I love it. Br brilliant job, great job. 10 out of 10, if I was going to rate this, absolutely would give it a 10 out of 10. No hesitation. And here is the very fun beach. A lot of plants. And a lot of items. Little boardwalk. And that is a great way to disguised a villager's house this is a villager's house um actually no it's not so basically they took a gazebo and they transformed it it looks like a villager's house and it looks like they just covered it with the storefront items but no they just put a gazebo and then covered that and it looks really good good hack if you ever want to make a fake house or shack on your island. And we got a relaxing hot tub area. And this is really interesting, a campsite with a library so you can read. You can read books. And here is a fishing boat area. I love all the vines on the mountain. 
and here's a fishing spot um, right next to a lighthouse. There is so many vines, it makes it look more whimsical. And here's this really cute summery looking area with this really cute changing room and really cute umbrella that matches the pastel theme. And here's a very overgrown beach with a bunch of weeds, plants, Hello Kiki, you traveled, you levitated to this area because I thought you were all the way to the right of the island and now you're here following me. Somehow you levitated towards wherever I was. Let's see where Kiki's house is. Like, where is their house supposed to be? Okay, Kiki's house is all the way over there and she wanted to, you know, stalk me a little bit. Cause I saw her really, I saw her on another spot and she, she somehow got to that spot. So I hope you guys enjoyed this amazing fun island. This was amazing. I really liked this tour and I'm glad I got to tour this. I've never seen an island like this. It is super unique and super fun and they have a lot of skills because they use a lot of inclines and bridges and they know how to terraform very well and this theme is already unique so it is kind of challenging when you, no one else has done a theme that you want to do you don't have any other inspiration other than whatever you think Okay, this is an item that I'm trying to find, and I do not know the name of it, and you guys need to help me out. This, I don't know, maybe it's called journal or something, but I have not seen the item, and I am looking for it. Let's just see if it's called a journal. Wait. Okay. Can I use this? Okay, I can't use this. Wait, can I use something else? Okay, I can't use any apps, but maybe it is called journal. If you guys know what that item is called, it would really be helping me out. You have to um, comment it so that I can go ahead and order it. I don't know if I have the item, but we'll see. But I really hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys are interested, I'm going to be doing daily island tours this week. So I will be posting daily an island tour so you guys can get a lot of inspiration and or you can just watch what creative islands people come up with so if that interests you then you can go ahead and subscribe and stay tuned so yeah i will see you guys very soon and i hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day and thank you for hang hanging out with me and goodbye i'll see you soon